Good morning and welcome to everyone. This is the opening of Business 411, the Business Policy Seminar. And my name is Tom Abbott. I'm going to be your instructor for this course. I am the Academic Program Manager here at Post University for Undergraduate Business. And I have been teaching this course in many forms, many times over, and it's never the same thing twice. So what I wanted to do with this little video here is to give you uh, an idea of who the, uh, who the guy behind the screen is and what the course is about, where we're going to go, a few, uh, maybe not ground rules, but a few hints, guideposts, if you will, as to how we're going to do things, what we're going to try to do, what we're going to try to accomplish, and how we're going to try to accomplish those things. So that being said, uh, I think what we have here is the course that, that tries to put everything all together. For many of you, this is, if not the last, it is one of the last courses you're going to take in your bachelor's degree program as you get towards the end. And we've always structured it so that this is something that you come to at the end of the program. We should uh, all be in here with, with at least senior standing. You're coming to the program with a lot of academic background, and so many of you are coming to the program with a lot of already work background, business background, that I think you're going to see now how things come together. What do we operate at when we now operate at what I'm going to call a senior executive level? And that's what this course is all about. So what we're going to do essentially is um, we're going to examine the concept of strategy, building strategy, how do we make a strategy for an organization, for a corporation, how does a business strategy come together, and then how is it implemented, how does it work? And this is not an easy thing to do because it implies that we have a feel for and an ability to, to direct all sorts of forces. And I think we're going to start out by seeing what forces play upon us as we try to formulate strategy and then go forward to that next wonderful step trying to implement it. So what we're going to do is we're going to combine several methods here. You'll notice in the course as we go forward, we have each week there, there's material from the, uh, from the text. There are PowerPoints that illustrate and explain the material from the text. There's a lot of outside articles and videos bringing in where uh, we have many experts in this field. And this is one of the most widely explored and written about and talked about fields in business, strategy and execution. Well, we're going to try to give you a lot of different perspectives on what people think. Uh, we're going to look at the internal and external forces that, that affect a business as it goes forward. I'm going to try to bring you a lot of my background into the course. I, I, I have a lot of experience uh, over 30 years before I became an educator uh, in corporate America. I was a manager, I was a general manager, I've been a chief financial officer uh, for a long time. I was a consultant uh, in my own practice with a, a small consulting firm where we specialized in organizational development issues, executive development issues, and of course, strategy development. So I have seen an awful lot and I hope to bring, just from my personal experience, a lot of background to you. Why are we going to do certain things certain ways? Because it's allow you to put into practice what you've learned. So a few hints. You'll notice there are very few assignments in this course. I value highly your participation in the discussion board. And the discussion board, the way I want to run that is I hope to stir up a little trouble at the beginning of every week with it by asking a good question and then sit back and watching you guys answer. Uh, doesn't mean I'm not reading everything, doesn't mean I'm not intimately involved, but you'll find that when I, the time I get to a 400 level business policy seminar course, I'm not jumping in and responding to every post, but I am reading every post. And I will jump in as necessary to, uh, to keep things directed or to maybe draw a little bit more out. But the burden is, to be quite honest, on you as, as a class and as individuals to participate and it's something I value highly. It's what we would be doing if we were all sitting together in this classroom. This is where we'd be, this is where we'd be talking about stuff. That's what I did. Um, the other part of the class that's going to unnerve a lot of people, and I always get some adverse reaction, major group project. And what we're going to be doing is a simulation exercise where I'm going to be asking to formulate a strategy to solve a real world business problem at a very high executive level and more about that as it comes.
go through the syllabus, go through everything that we have here. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. But I just want to welcome to you all of you. Is I'm looking forward to doing this course again. As I say, for me, it's never the same thing twice. And I hope we have a great journey through the uh, the wonderful world of strategy and plan formulation. Thanks very much. Bye.